All the guns you'll be seeing today are available on solware.co.uk based in Tamworth. Hello all and welcome. Uh, it's match day four, the PCP Airgun Battle League and it's the rifle edition. Today we have a, a game that's come a little bit too soon for me but that's how the draw works sometimes. Uh, both these guns won their first games and to be quite honest with you the way they were shooting they looked like they could go on to win either one of these guns. We have the Kral Jumbo Maxi and we have the Reximex Pretensis. Both of these guns, as I say, looked really good in their outing day. Uh, both won against the two Gamos, if I remember right. So, obviously, like, I'm expecting big things from both these guns. Um, could be a tight one, this, I think. Anyway, I think this could be the one that decides who wins the league, to be honest with you, unless the likes of the T-Rex or maybe the Lyra, the GX250 could come back into it once it was sorted out, I don't know. But um, yeah, it should be a good one this. Let's get them out there, let's see who wins it. It's round one, and it'll be the Jumbo Maxi to go first in the left hand card. Right, let's see who he gets on today. Just a bit low, that'll be a nine, I think. As the pretenders kept it zero and got a good chance of taking this. Yeah, it takes a ten. That's probably a 10 for the Jumbo Maxi, who uh, doesn't seem as accurate today as he was uh, in its last round. Yep, that looks a 10 again for the Pretensis. a 10 for the Maxi, who does seem at the moment just to be a little touch low. Just give him a little nudge, just to help him. Yeah, thought so. Pretensis is out of pellets, so a top up of Barracuda 18s for him. Both nice ones to use these. Uh, the crown a little bit more mechanical with the cocking arm I'm finding. But, uh, Neither of the guns are far away from where they need to be, which is a good thing. Nobody wants a gun that you pull out the bag every time, it needs adjusting. You want to pull a gun out of the bag and it's, it's ready to go, no messing. Might be just on the 10 that one. If not, it's annoying, but it's very close. So 10. So they're only just in now that the 10s the for the uh, for the jumbo, they're not uh, well in. That's 
a cracking shot. That's where I like to see a 10 without doubt straight through the middle. So 10 again. It's going to be hard to count this one up because uh, there's still possibilities that all the jumbos, even though they're a little bit uh, all over the place, they're, uh, they're still 10s. I've picked the bung up again there. I'm having a bit of a nightmare. Good job I'm checking. The only reason I knew I could see the, the pellet was getting low in the other gun and then he just topped up the pretenses. Yeah, another bullseye and a good one. So, I'll get the cards in and I'll have a count up and get a set up for round two. Results from game one, <coughs> 50 for the Presensis, 49 for the Jumbo, Carl Jumbo Maxi, mm. so it's very close still, time for a little bit of pellet on pellet fun in the next round, who can do that, let's find out. That's a nice 10 to start off from the jumbo. Nice 10 from the pretensis. Another nice 10 from the Jumbo who seems to have found its groove. Another 10 from the Pretensis. I think I can see the way this is going at the minute. Maybe a 9 or a 10 that one, not 100% with that one, I'm going to be honest. Another 10. Just wondering now about that one pellet. Is it a nine or is it a ten at the moment? Otherwise we're looking at two full houses. Another ten from the potensis. Shoots really well as that gun, I really do like it. Ah last shot and the crawl runs out of ammo. So it's getting reloaded. As most of you know, these crawl magazines do have a habit of being a little bit iffy. But uh, this is not the normal fat crawl magazine, this is more like a Reximex one to be fair. It's a little bit slimmer one. I have my doubts, this is a Reximex magazine that uh, they're using to be honest with you. Okay. Well, as a matter of fact, yeah, it might be a crown magazine, but it's the old glass fronted one. Mm. 
Yeah, bangs another ten in just to finish off. Pretensis. Yeah, another ten. I'm hoping that those are two full rounds because you like to see these go into a third round, wouldn't you? I'll go and check. Round two was a drawn round, so we do go into our final round. So then, there's one point in it. 99 and 100 points has been scored in the two rounds, so it's all about whoever misses a shot in this one. Maxi in first. Smack bang in the middle, no problems at all. Pretenses as well here, on the chance of course to do the full house of a 135. Yeah, that's the first one, five points each there. The maxi, just banging them right in the centre. Seems to have warmed up a little from the start. Ah, Potensis might have one just slightly off there. Hmm. Loses the chance there as well, I would say now to do his 1 through 5, and he was well on for it. Oh, just about gets that one too, he's been bang on all day. Strange. Yeah, that's in. Now, every one of the shots for the pretenses has gone to the right. So I am going to give it a, a little bit of a touch, just in case it has just slightly lost anything. Hopefully this brings him closer to the centre shot. He's in that time, but he's a little touch high as well, so before he takes his last shot, we'll give him a hand with that. A lot depends on this last shot now. Obviously, at the moment, the maxi is in the lead, but uh, he's in. So the pretensis now can't catch the maxi, and he's run out of pellet right on the last shot anyway. Even though it doesn't really matter about the shot, to be fair, because he can't catch him on. I'm sure that second shot, I think, or first shot was a miss. And if it is, he's five points down from there. So, but. 
could be a big scoring round this for both guns. I mean, um, the Maxi there has done a, a one three four. He's one shy of the the fullness, and that was the first shot it took today. It seemed a little bit off with its first shot, but after that it picked up. So. Wow, smack bang in the middle. Now, I've just had a second look at those shots. I'm not 100% sure, you know, the pretenses has missed. So I'm going to get the cards in and see how it went. This just goes to show you how fine the margins are. Uh, on the second shot for the Reximex Potensis here is just millimetre, I mean a millimetre outside of putting the ring where he would have got his five points. Whereas shot four, which was for the Kral Jumbo Maxi, he was only just inside by a millimetre and a bit, so he's only just got that. Now, it's the name of the game, isn't it? It's what you shoot on the day. And the pretensis was looking really good up until that last round uh, where he sort of went off to the left and high. Don't know why because he's been shooting really well. Uh, as far as I know he didn't get any knocks or bangs so a bit weird that one. But his last shot we levelled him out and he put a perfect one in the bonus shot. Perfect hole in the bonus shot. But it's no use having an inquiry about is it. Today's winner is the Kral. Jumbo Maxi, I'll update the leagues and I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye bye now.